Hi, this is Bob Berkovich, DuPont Pioneer Field Agronomist in Wisconsin, with your weekly agronomy update on corn root development. The radical is the first part of the plant to sprout from the seed. The seminal roots also originate from the seed and together with the radical are responsible for early water uptake and limited nutrient uptake while the young seedling gets most of its nutrition and most of its energy from reserves that are stored within the seed. By V1, the nodal root system begins to develop at the crown of the plant, usually about three quarters of an inch below the soil surface. By V3, the nodal root system begins to take a more prominent role in water and nutrient uptake. And by V6, it has completely taken over this function, as well as the function of anchoring the plant within the soil. An environment within that corn row that's moist, aerated, pretty clod free, not too compacted, um, and not having a whole lot of residue within that corn row are all good things to help that plant develop and grow that nodal root system. As the corn plant advances past the V6 stage, it will begin a period of very rapid growth, placing large demands on that root system to provide the water and nutrients from the soil to fuel that growth needed to build a big plant to hopefully give us the corn yields that we're looking for. For more information on root development, please see the links following this video or get a hold of your local Pioneer Sales Professional. Thank you.